Shen Fei traveled through the Marvel world and became a member of the Hydra Research Institute. Acquire the talent of a master of scientific research, able to insight and understand all knowledge truths. The body possesses the power of the spirit of evolution, capable of absorbing all that enhances one's own strength. The development of Super Soldier Serum at the beginning is just the beginning. Study the abilities of different extraordinary individuals and organically integrate them into oneself. I will use scientific research to recreate the Marvel world, the god of the human world. The self-healing factor of Wolverine. Wolverine, since you've dissected everything, it's okay to do it again. Superpower. Hulk, don't leave. The body of steel. Hot vision. Does absorbing the sun make it stronger? X. Men, stop me. Finally, Shen Fei held the infinite gem and looked at Mia Ba with a smile, saying, Do you want this? I have many, but I am very interested in you, the Eternal Clan. For the sake of the plot, it was not entirely written according to Marvel's timeline, and you also know how messy Marvel's own timeline can be. Keywords of the novel Mei Mang I have independently evolved into a super without pop-ups. Mei Mang I have independently evolved into a super. Download the full text. Mei Mang I have independently evolved into a super. Latest chapter reading Chapter 1. Organizational Clearance, New Book on the Road. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 1. Organizational Clearance, New Book on the Road, in the Wilderness of Tennessee, United States. Underneath the lifeless plain lies a huge underground research base. A handsome young man in his early twenties is constantly operating a computer with his fingers. There is a chest badge hanging on the left chest, with Shen Fei and a series of engravings written on it. Researcher 21.03, Shen Fei is responsible for researching the serum of super soldiers, which can be regarded as the idealistic force of super soldier serum in Marvel World. However, Shen Fei is not serving the US military, but rather serving a certain organization, Hydra. Shen, how is the situation now? The person in charge, Jason, looked at the data standing next to him, and saw a huge machine running in front of him, inside which a volunteer was struggling in pain. No, it's still not possible. Shen Fei shook his head. With the injection of the medicine, the volunteers inside the machine looked even more painful. In the end, in the eyes of the two, the volunteers inside turned into a puddle of thick syrup. The bloody thick plasma splattered the entire machine around with blood stains. Damn it. It failed again. Jason roared low and looked at Shen Fei, saying, Keep trying. We don't have much time. After speaking, Jason left the laboratory directly, leaving Shen Fei alone in the laboratory, his eyes flickering as he heard Jason's tone. Time is running out. Organizing opponents is not as kind. Shen Fei murmured, thinking of the methods used by the nine-headed snake to deal with useless research institutes. Take away research materials and eliminate all those who know the secret. They will send a special team to clear it. It's not like you're about to die right after crossing over. Shen Fei is not from here, he comes from the earth of his past life. He didn't expect to travel to Marvel and even serve Hydra. In fact, it should be said that the predecessor was serving the nine-headed snake, and this organization was already extremely cruel to useless subordinates. It's all about using it as a tool. I hope these two abilities can be awesome. Shen Fei looked at the ability he got when he passed through, which was his unique soul talent. Ability Acquisition, the Master of Scientific Research and the Spirit of Evolution Master of Scientific Research you are the master of scientific research, possessing unparalleled research abilities. You can understand all the knowledge you want to understand and master it, and use it to research anything you want. Spirit of Evolution Your body will have unlimited potential for evolution, be able to accommodate everything, and receive the power that transforms into itself to the greatest extent possible. 
The master of scientific research can give Shen Fei the power to analyze all extraordinary things, allowing him to wait until he creates all extraordinary objects that exist in this world. Just give him enough time to create everything. The spirit of evolution can allow Shen Fei to integrate all extraordinary powers within himself, gradually evolving from an ordinary person to a powerful existence. Nowadays, Shen Fei is no longer the powerless Shen Fei who could only wait for death, but the leader of scientific research with a terrifying power. Back then, Stark was able to research the Ark in the cave, and it was reasonable for Shen Fei to independently analyze the serum of the super soldier. That's right, it's about studying Super Soldier Serum. After all, with readily available information, Shen Fei naturally wants to master extraordinary powers. Now that Super Soldier Serum is right in front of him, he naturally wants to use it for research. Just to cover it up, if the Hydra knew he had developed Super Soldier Serum, even if he didn't die, he would be imprisoned in the base to study various things for them. He doesn't want to lose his freedom, so he hasn't shown any ability to develop serum. He casually took a drink from the side and was about to slowly break through the super soldier serum. Warning, warning. Just as Shen Fei was constantly verifying the formula, suddenly the entire laboratory sounded a severe warning. Shen Fei was taken aback for a moment. At this moment, the voice of Jason, the head of his laboratory, rang out in his laboratory, filled with anxiety. Shen, the cleaning team has suddenly arrived, and it is very likely that the organization will forcibly detonate this base. Why? Shen Fei quickly asked. I'm not sure. All the entrances and exits of the research institute are now under control. Except for the security personnel, all the researchers have been arrested. This remark made Shen Fei frown and closed Jason's conversation. Shet, can't you give me some time? Shen Fei took a deep breath, feeling unlucky himself. He had just crossed over and encountered something like this. The result of being caught will definitely not be much better. We have to escape. But how can we escape? Shen Fei's head flew around quickly, and his gaze quickly fell on the machine in front of him. This is a replica of the injection drug used by the US team at that time, which could provide energy for the injector. He is now an ordinary person, and the entrance and exit of the research institute are tightly controlled by people. With Shen Fei's weak body, which has been studied for years, he may be killed before running two steps. So there is only one way for him to break the game. Before being caught, research super soldier serum. Then he injected it into his own body and quickly absorbed it through the spirit of evolution, becoming a little superhero like the American team. After determining his idea, Shen Fei began to crazily calculate the remaining difficult problems to solve. As various formulas were written on blank sheets of paper, Shen Fei continued to unravel the difficulty of the research group in studying serum. In the office of the head of the research institute, a person wearing Hydra soldier clothes is making a phone call. Jason was tied to a chair, listening to this soldier talking to the Baron. Baron, researchers are constantly being captured. A serious voice came from the phone, hmm, prepare all the remaining information, clear all the backup materials, and demolish the base without leaving any trace. Yes. Remember not to leave any traces. The soldier skillfully turned on the surveillance to see if anyone had missed. At this moment, I saw Shen Fei in the laboratory and took out his walkie-talkie, saying, there is still someone in laboratory too, go and catch him. Yes. A sound came from the walkie-talkie, and then he looked at Jason beside him and said, you scientific research waste should die quickly, wasting so much of the organization's resources. With these resources, the organization doesn't even know how many soldiers have been trained Jason stared at the Hydra soldier and said coldly, if it weren't for us, wouldn't you all be useless? What is your subordinate doing? He wouldn't want to study any serum. I really thought I could research it out. I just said that organizations use so many resources to study what serum is useful, it's better to use it to study exoskeletons, if you have this ability, go talk to the Winter Warrior. 
A new book is on its way, with Marvel as the main focus, and a fan of beautiful comics. End of this chapter. Chapter 2. Moments of Life and Death. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 2 Moments of Life and Death Before Jason left, Shen Fei had actually been deducing the Super Soldier Serum. There were originally two or three difficult problems that he planned to take slowly. Who knew that the organizational clearance came so quickly that he almost exhausted his brain and constantly calculated the final problem when Jason reported it to him. He is currently solving the last difficult problem. Not long ago. Shen Fei's face was pale, but his eyes lit up as he looked at the perfect formula in his hand. At this moment. Shen Fei exclaimed that he had actually deduced it. You should know that the U.S. military, organizations like Hydra, etc. are unable to deduce it again. But in the end, he easily managed to get it out. Although the Hydra has actually solved most of the difficulties, there are only a few extremely difficult ones that cannot be overcome. But sometimes these few steps are the most crucial. So many years have passed, only he has solved it. This is all the terror of the master of scientific research. With this talent, Shen Fei believes that as long as he doesn't die, I can definitely climb to the highest point of this universe and take a look. The next step is to prepare Super Soldier Serum. As long as it can be prepared, use a machine to inject it. If I can succeed and go out easily, I will also have the power to protect myself. This research institute is just one of many groups studying serum, without any disabled super soldiers like the Winter Soldier, nor any superpowers. So even the Hydra soldiers who came to clear them were just ordinary people, at most some veterans. A perfect super soldier is enough to kill indiscriminately here. Shen Fei closed the laboratory from the inside and then closed the password lock outside. It can only be manually opened from within. This was originally to prevent foreign enemies from entering and by time to destroy the data. Now it has become Shen Fei's last protective umbrella. The entire laboratory is made of tempered glass. Even fully armed soldiers need some time to enter. These are enough time for me to inject serum after closing the door, Shen Fei ran towards the experimental platform. Along the way, various machines were constantly turned on, and in no time, several bottles of reagents were added to my hands. In his hands, the reagents are constantly mixed together, alternating blue and green, and various crystals are precipitated. After stirring them with the machine, the essence inside is extracted. The soldier who had been staring at the surveillance in the office frowned slightly and said, what is this guy doing? Does he still want to break through the problem and clear the bleeding in such a short time? The soldier captain sneered, do you think there will be a miracle? The entire organization is trying to restore super soldier serum, and an ordinary researcher is begging for a miracle to appear. Trying to escape by injecting serum is really a pipe dream. After thinking for a moment, he immediately took out his communication tool and said, Team 13, go to Laboratory 2, and the others continue to search for the other researchers. Otherwise, those crazy dogs from the Divine Shield Bureau will come knocking on him. In the laboratory, Shen Fei, who was preparing the medication, glanced at the monitoring of the laboratory. The constant flow of soldiers made his movements accelerate uncontrollably, and a wave of pressure began to emerge out of thin air. It wasn't long before they came knocking on his door. Quickly, waves of hurried footsteps echoed outside the laboratory, and through the transparent glass, a fully armed team suddenly spotted Shen Fei's figure. Find Shen Fei, he's in the laboratory and has turned on all the machines inside. It seems like he's working on something. The soldiers led by him shouted at the pager. Use a password. The password lock has been disabled. It can only be opened from inside. Shoot me through the glass. The captain's voice was extremely cold. Is this guy challenging the authority of their cleaning team? A group of people began to pick up their automatic rifles, and the metal storm suddenly blasted towards the glass. Bang 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 Shen Fei listened to the sound of gunshots, and a cold sweat broke out on his forehead. 
His grip on the reagent quickened a bit, just a little, just a little. Shen Fei gritted his teeth, frantically squeezing his brain and arms, fast but not chaotic, every step must be correct, and he has no chance of failure. In the office, the soldier captain who was watching the surveillance saw Shen Fei's movements and frowned, saying to himself, this guy isn't really mixing super soldier serum, is he? Is this guy crazy? If it fails, it's better to just die. Is this guy scared out of his mind now? He has seen many volunteers participating in experiments, and even some of the bodies were handled by their teams. Knowing how painful it would be for volunteers who fail injections. This is completely pushing oneself towards a dead end. But the soldier captain felt a little uneasy and opened the phone, what happened? Sir, I need to report some intelligence to you. On the other side of the United States. Baron Straker is looking at a screen, which shows the internal situation of the research institute. He saw Shen Fei constantly tinkering with things in the laboratory, shook his head and said to the phone, don't worry, take your time. If the super soldier serum that the organization has been studying for so long is studied like this. The others are also too useless. He just glanced at the information called by Shen Fei, but didn't take it to heart. If it were so easy to study the serum of super soldiers, what would their years of research on Hydra be? In the office, the soldier captain heard the adults in different tone and did not express his concerns, so he had to hang up the phone. Outside the laboratory, with continuous shooting, a small crack appeared in the glass with a creaking sound. You can see here. The cleaning team members all showed a hint of laughter, and the turtle shell was finally broken by them. It's really difficult to hit. Shet, it's just for this one person that we've wasted so much energy and bullets. Watching Shen Fei continue to stir up trouble inside, the members of the cleaning team sneered. Keep going, I'll use that guy as a target and have fun. Who knows, if he comes up with that terrible reagent, then we'll still be good people helping him out. Ha ha ha. Inside. Shen Fei stopped his movements and began shaking the test tube in his hand. The colorless liquid inside the test tube began to change color, and soon a brilliant liquid flowed inside like a sapphire, like an artwork. Looking at the medicine inside, Shen Fei breathed a sigh of relief and finally discovered it. Super Soldier Serum But this serum cannot be injected directly, it needs to enter that machine. Direct injection will only make the body unable to receive energy nourishment, and then be directly drained of the body's energy, which will turn into a corpse. Shen Fei does not want to become a corpse himself. Seeing the broken glass, I quickly started the machine and put the serum into it. Lie down inside the machine as a whole. Super Soldier, Activate. End of this chapter. Chapter 3 He seems to have succeeded. You are listening at NovelFull.Audio Chapter 3 He seems to have succeeded. The people outside saw Shen Fei's entire body lying inside the machine. They were all people who had experienced it many times, and even participated in some experiments. Those who understood the inside story were all smiling. This guy is really looking for death. It's better to die in our hands. The serum of failure, although I haven't tried it before, I have seen it. That person begged me to get rid of it. This kid is crazy, isn't he? In the middle of the office. The soldier saw this scene, saw Shen Fei lying inside, and thought of Lord Baron's words. Also dispelling his own anxiety, this guy is dead. The soldier watched as Shen Fei injected all the serum and called to report the situation. After lying down in the machine, Shen Fei had tubes sticking to his body, while sapphire-like drugs were injected into his muscles. In an instant, he felt extreme pain, as if his whole body was about to be torn apart. Pain. Shen Fei knew it would be very painful, but he didn't expect it to be so painful. The excruciating pain that invaded his nerves made him want to faint, but he knew he couldn't faint. Once he fainted, he would never be able to wake up again. Without willpower as a driving force, 
to control one's own body will ultimately lead to the collapse of the body. That's also why he volunteered for the beauty pageant team and was able to succeed. Although he himself is weak, his will is strong, which is why he became the chosen target for the super soldier. Shen Fei's sweat flowed incessantly throughout his body, trembling incessantly. He was already trying his best to control his muscles, his eyes bulging as if about to fall out. Hold on. Shen Fei roared in his heart. As long as he perseveres this time and relies on his talent, he can traverse the universe and even touch the upper limit of the world. It's better not to just cross over and die. And now he has successfully injected serum and died because he couldn't bear it, so he's too useless. I have finally traveled through it, and even have such an incredible talent. He is unwilling even when he dies. At this moment, Shen Fei's muscles were constantly bulging, and the electricity in the research base was constantly being drained. It should be noted that when the US team became a super soldier, they almost drained half of the electricity in the city area to succeed. Although his spirit of evolution can help him quickly fuse potions, it cannot make up for this energy consumption. The force surging in from outside was like countless magma flowing through his body, almost burning his muscles. This extremely hot energy is even more terrifying than the tearing pain when it was just injected. Shen Fei tightly grasped his palm, his nails embedded in his flesh, and blood flowed out from the cut wound, but this pain was already covered by the pain all over his body. The muscles of the entire human body seemed to be expanding, like a monster composed of sarcomas the cleaning team members outside were a bit scared when they saw this scene inside the machine, which was the appearance of the experimental body injected with failed serum. It's better to be shot and killed by Lousy. What are you thinking about before you die? The cleaning team members led by him couldn't help but sneer, stop talking, quickly kill him. Reinforced bulletproof glass, covered in cracks. Although the cleaning team knows that this guy is doomed, it is still safer to die under their command. A metal storm kept sweeping through the glass, shattering with a loud bang. The cleaning team members all smiled when they saw this. Finally broken, I will also buy some of this glass in the future, and I won't be afraid of bullets when I leave it at home. Go in and give this guy a few bullets, let's settle it. He 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 he, look at me. I promise he won't suffer. A group of people rushed in, while in the laboratory before the glass broke. In the office, the soldier answered the phone and said, Baron, he just injected himself with failed serum. Life is still more difficult than death. It won't be long. Hmm. Suddenly, the words of the soldier captain came to a sudden halt, followed by a sound of gasping air. What happened? The baron suddenly felt something was amiss. He didn't die. The soldier captain's words were full of disbelief. Now in the laboratory. Shen Fei maintained his forcefulness without losing consciousness, enduring waves of pain. The spirit of evolution has finally played its role. A warm current surged up inside the body, constantly absorbing the electricity transmitted from the machine, strengthening Shen Fei's body. And at this time, a surge of force surged up, causing Shen Fei's originally thin and weak body to swell, and his muscles were filled with explosive force. A large amount of steam spread out from the open machine, and Shen Fei clenched his fist to feel the power in his palm. Is this the spirit of evolution? It can absorb all the potions in such a short time. At this moment, when Shen Fei heard the bulletproof glass shatter, a cold light flashed in his eyes. Next is my home court, he said pick up the surgical scissors that were prepared early on, which were originally intended for dissecting volunteers who had failed the experiment. Now they have better uses. Sharp scissors are powerful enough to become a deadly weapon. After stepping out of the machine, Shen Fei was completely naked and tightly grasped the bulletproof glass that had been pulled out of the machine. He quickly rolled and hid behind the experimental platform. The team members who rushed in knew something was wrong when they saw the steam spreading out of the machine. Roaring loudly, shoot, shoot. But Shen Fei had already dodged behind the experimental platform like lightning. 
the cleaning team members looked at each other, their eyes filled with fear. Holy crap, he didn't die. How could that be so? Is this person successful because they are so fast? The members of the cleaning team led by him, with a hint of fear in their eyes, quickly picked up the walkie-talkie and said, Captain, he seems to have succeeded. The only one who is still alive after injecting serum is Shen Fei. The rest of the people are treated as thick slurry. I have seen. The voice of the soldier came from the walkie-talkie. It is also full of terror. The baron across the phone shouted, What exactly happened? Sir, he hasn't died. The voice of the soldier captain was filled with terror, but he knew how strong super soldiers were. How to deal with the addition of a super soldier in the research institute. But the baron's voice was filled with excitement, I've succeeded. I didn't expect an ordinary researcher to actually study super soldier serum. Bring him back to me. Have your subordinates test him for me to see if he really succeeded. End of this chapter. Chapter 4 Shocking the Nine-Headed Snake with a Bit of Hanging You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 4 Shocking the Nine-Headed Snake with a Bit of Hanging in the Laboratory The security personnel remembered seeing the performance of the American team before, and their fear drove them to keep shooting. However, almost all the metal platforms are made of solid metal, and bullets can only leave small pits and cannot harm Shen Fei at all. They are shooting and moving towards the back of the experimental platform, even if it's a super soldier, as long as they get shot, they will get injured, and as long as they get injured, they will die. And Shen Fei, leaning against the back of the experimental platform, listened to the sound of gunshots and estimated the position with the help of a distant mirror. In an instant, he moved and rolled up from the other side of the experimental platform, pulling off a white coat and draped it over his body. He quickly dodged while his brain was frantically calculating the route, crossing several platforms at once. He held the bulletproof shell of the machine in his right hand and a surgical knife in his left hand, which he had just picked up. The surgical knife is suitable for close combat. Two steps into the crowd, the security personnel who were originally frightened began shooting. However, even with the constant gunfire, Shen Fei remained calm in judging the situation, his bulletproof shell constantly blocking bullets and making a loud bang. With his current reaction, these bullets simply cannot harm him, let alone add a shield. This bulletproof shield is quite durable. As he rushed into the crowd, with a surgical knife in his hand and a strong physique, a tiger entered the flock, and the situation instantly reversed. In his eyes, these security personnel can be considered physically strong among ordinary people, and in his eyes, their speed is similar to that of a child. The other party had just raised the gun and aimed it at him when he came to the person, and the surgical knife in his hand suddenly started to bleed. Puzzy. Puzzy. Warm and viscous blood sprayed out under the pressure of the human body, mottled and falling onto Shen Fei's face. Not for a while. Shen Fei was like chopping melons and vegetables, constantly cutting through his throat with a surgical knife and solving it. A noisy sound sounded, and now the entire laboratory is quiet, with only blood and water on the ground constantly spreading. Only Shen Fei remained standing. His white coat and face were bloodstained, and his face, combined with his appearance, truly resembled a demon from hell. The next step is to go to the main control room, Shen Fei murmured. There is still some information in the main control room that he must obtain, otherwise, all of it will be wasted. Pick up a gun and bulletproof vest from the ground, put them on, and prepare the magazine. He must get the data and leave quickly. He is just a super soldier now, not everyone is an American team. If the opponent sends over super soldiers like the Winter Soldier who are incomplete, they will be difficult to defeat with two fists and four hands, and they may also capsize. His enmity with the Hydra, when he becomes strong, he can easily destroy it. With his current talent, he has this confidence. Before speaking out, he needs to obtain the remaining information about this research institute, which can help him grow quickly. He is not the protagonist of the comeback, 
just relying on a super serum is enough. He needs stronger strength to deal with the Hydra and future crises. Shen Fei rushed towards the outside, and when the soldier captain saw this scene, his whole body trembled and his pupils contracted. Just now, Shen Fei has definitely become a super soldier, and even has a sense of autonomy. His voice trembled slightly, how could that be? The Baron's voice continued excitedly, has it been tested? He could only see the blazing flames. Shen Fei had acted too quickly just now, and by the time he connected to the surveillance, it had already ended. Sir, Shen Fei seems to have succeeded. The soldier captain quickly said, adjusting the surveillance to the route that Shen Fei had just gone. During the surveillance, a black-haired young man wearing a blood-soaked white coat was running wildly in the hallway. His eyes were normal and calm, without the madness of those incomplete super-soldiers. Struck saw Shen Fei's expression and said, Is this the successful sample? Yes. Yes. Baron Struck quickly stood up and roared, What are you still doing, you useless person? Catch this guy alive, he's a genius and a perfect sample. I absolutely can't kill him. Grab his words. Promote you to the captain of ten teams. Baron Straker never expected an unexpected joy. An unresolved researcher actually unleashed infinite potential to escape. Developed Super Soldier Serum In order to ensure safety, another phone call was immediately made, send me a team and quickly go to the 31st research base to catch a person named Shen Fei. Wake up another super soldier and coordinate on the side. As long as we catch Shen Fei, these garbage will be useless. The super soldiers controlled by Hydra now have flaws and are easily out of control. They are usually frozen. Wake up when needed. Moreover, this failed product not only requires strong-willed soldiers as raw materials, but also has a low success rate, making mass production impossible. If we can get the perfect super soldier serum. These garbage are no longer needed, even a researcher can use them, let alone soldiers. At that time, he will have a bunch of super soldiers under his hands that are similar to the American team. Enough to strike at those useless members of the Divine Shield Bureau. Thinking of this, Baron Straker had already begun to fantasize. In the office. Upon hearing the Baron's arrangement, the soldier captain was also somewhat excited and became the captain of ten small teams, so he no longer had to worry about being eliminated by the organization at any time. Thinking of this, I quickly picked up the walkie-talkie and shouted loudly, the security personnel will stop him for me, but remember not to use a gun. You must capture him alive. If he dies, you won't want to live either. After receiving orders, the security personnel in the research institute ran in teams towards the direction of the laboratory. Soon, they collided with Shen Fei who rushed out. The battle erupted in an instant. In the hallway, firearms were already difficult to use, coupled with Shen Fei's extremely fast speed, a sprint rushed into the crowd. Immediately, the killing began, wielding knives and pulling a person as a shield. The screams of screams and the sound of air leakage from a cut throat echoed incessantly, and blood surged on the ground. Security personnel covered their throats and fell to the ground one by one. Security personnel from afar were smashed by a corpse. Then a series of gunshots erupted, and security personnel fell one by one. Soon, Shen Fei arrived at the data control room. Without saying a word, he rushed in and killed all the security personnel completely. Start typing the keyboard quickly, copying all the important information inside to a hard drive. One of the materials. It's called the X Weapon Program. That's right, it's the plan to create the Death Attendant, Little Wolf Girl, and Wolverine. His next goal is Logan. That Wolverine. The terrifying self. Healing factor of Wolverine is his next goal, as long as he doesn't die, all his plans can be realized. Shen Fei must acquire this ability, and the key is that there are already successful experimental samples of the self. Healing ability of Wolverine. Death Attendant and Wolf Maiden. 
so he prefers to obtain something that is highly practical and easy to obtain. This can ensure that he has strong self.protection ability and successful samples. Nature is Shin Fei's priority choice. Of course, not only the Wolverine, but also the information of other superpowers has been transmitted to the hard drive. These people will be a puzzle for Shen Fei's future path. Over the past few hours, Shen Fei had already thought of the road ahead, which was Marvel's world. When it comes to Marvel, one cannot avoid beautiful comics. When it comes to comics, the most powerful character among them is Da Chao, known as the god of the human world. There are many forms of big supermarkets, such as small town supermarkets, silver supermarkets, golden supermarkets, and even later thinking supermarkets. He plans to use his own abilities to bring the god of humanity, which is himself, into this world. From super soldier serum to obtaining this information. He had already planned his future evolutionary path, the abilities he needed to acquire, and who the target would be. He has a rough calculation of Superman's basic abilities, but of course, he knows that this path is somewhat difficult and even requires facing many enemies. But with the confidence given to him by the master of scientific research and the spirit of evolution, as well as his own understanding of the Marvel world. Shen Fei has confidence in bringing back the gods of the world here. End of this chapter Chapter 5 Breaking the Game you are listening at NovelFull.audio. The source has no content or has errors. Chapter 6 A Group of Gorillas Who Only Know Brute Force You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 6 A Group of Gorillas Who Only Know Brute Force This small laboratory is not far away. Shen Fei rushed into the small laboratory after a few sprints and immediately locked himself in. The nine-headed snake was still wealthy and the materials used in these laboratories were quite sturdy. Can withstand it for a while. He just needs some time. Boom. Boom. The elite team that followed closely kept bombarding the door, and a depression kept appearing on the door. Soon, they would rush in. Outside the door, the head of the elite team shouted loudly, Don't waste your time, this thing can hardly stop us. Hurry up and come out, otherwise it's wasting everyone's time. If we catch you, we'll make sure you suffer a bit. Now Shen Fei has been constantly dismantling various experimental equipment and quickly hid in the blind corner of the surveillance system for assembly. The door can still hold for half a minute. This half minute is enough. He plans to create a high dot voltage generator that can instantly increase the subtle voltage to an extremely terrifying level. Many electronic devices will exist, and there are even many complete high dot voltage generators in the laboratory. But these high dot voltage generators all have protective measures in place, and once they are incomplete, it is difficult to generate strong high voltage. Shen Fei now wants to remove that protective measure. Create something that can release high pressure without restraint. Although this type of high dot voltage generator with high voltage and low current is difficult to kill, it is more like giving people a momentary feeling of electric shock, unless it is too high and bad luck. When the voltage passes through the heart, it instantly stops the heart. Otherwise, it is more likely to be short dot term muscle paralysis followed by paralysis. And the key is that a sudden burst of high pressure can instantly burn out certain components inside mechanical products, such as exoskeletons. As long as one component is burned out, it is almost impossible to move. At that time, the exoskeleton, which could have provided tremendous power, would have become a cage that imprisoned them. Shen Fei quickly dismantled things, took out the circuit board and copper wire, and his hands were moving rapidly, welding the circuit board and constantly winding the wires. He occasionally looked up to observe the surroundings and the door that was about to be damaged. Boom! Creaking. The door had already made an unbearable sound, with a bang. The door opened, and Shen Fei also completed it. A high dot voltage generator resembling a stick appeared in his hand. You block this place, he has nowhere to escape. One of the people they left behind blocked the door, 
and Shen Fei ran in completely seeking death. Looking at Shen Fei, who was on high alert, the leader let out a low roar and said, leave another person to coordinate, be careful if he has electric shock equipment under his hands. But by this time, Shen Fei had already two sprints in front of him. Pay attention to the stick in his hand. Don't get hit by him. I thought he came up with something. Isn't this just an electric shock rod? Our exoskeleton has already been coated with a layer of anti-electric paint. Do you really think it's useful? I can't transmit electricity even if I knock on my body. Someone sneered. The leader of the team and the other two also rushed towards Shen Fei at the same time, but the next moment they found that the team leader suddenly didn't move. They heard the team leader yelling softly, be careful. Ah. But the next moment, a huge arc fell on them, and for a moment, the exoskeleton made a subtle popping sound, and then lost power. Shen Fei seemed to be the thunder god who controlled lightning. With a wave of the copper wire ring in his hand, the exoskeleton on the supporting person's body also made a thumping sound. The people blocking the door had not even figured it out when they heard the captain's call, but a copper wire ring had already landed on his exoskeleton. Five people, five exoskeletons standing still, all five of them were stunned, feeling their numb muscles. At this moment, Shen Fei smiled and said, let's not say that your anti-electric paint is not fully applied, and do you understand what breakdown effect is? A group of gorillas with only brute force, they don't understand anything. While speaking, the surgical knife in hand fell. Puzzy. Puzzy. A series of blood spurted out, and all five of them lost their composure in their eyes. Before dying, they couldn't understand what Shen Fei meant. Shen Fei made an international gesture towards the surveillance camera and loudly said, Fuck the squid. Cutting the circuit of the exoskeleton with a surgical knife and removing the two power sources that were not damaged by high voltage, these weights were not important to him, but the power sources were a weapon for him. Even if used as a bomb. After handling it, he threw away the high dot voltage generator that had almost been drained of electricity by him, and rushed towards the outside door holding the surgical knife and the power source. Because he knows that the support from the Hydra is definitely endless, and whoever the boss of this base is, they will know the importance of Super Soldier Serum. If he stays here, he will definitely come and catch him. So he must leave quickly, otherwise he won't be able to leave then. He lifted the gun he had just picked up and kept shooting at the security guards who were chasing him. Without an exoskeleton, how could these people possibly stop the bullets? A series of screams rang out, and by then Shen Fei had already rushed out to the door. The continuous ascent of stairs, this base is underground in the wilderness. Fortunately, it is not very deep, and it is walked by stairs, otherwise it would be even more troublesome for Shen Fei to rush out. His gaze fell on the car on the wilderness, which was a jeep. Looking at the cage on top, it was used to transport volunteers. A punch shattered the glass, threw the object at the passenger seat, pulled out the two wires inside the lock hole, and tied them together. Boom! A loud engine sound sounded. The car started and used the remaining bullets from the gun to puncture all the rear wheels of the other vehicles, causing a hissing sound of air leakage and bursting these tires. Shen Fei stepped on the gas pedal, and Jeep shot away, raising dust in the wilderness. The strong wind howled outside the window, and the dusty air rushed into his nostrils, washing away the rich bloody smell. At this moment, Shen Fei really felt free. He looked ahead and escaped, which was the great responsibility of the world. He wandered around. Of course, he understands that things are definitely not over yet. The Hydra will definitely chase after him like a mad dog, desperately searching for his trail and biting him. They won't allow Shen Fei to wander outside with perfect super soldier serum so he can't relax yet. Next, he needs to search for Logan and study his self-healing factors to replicate onto himself. He just needs to prepare in advance. You should know that Logan is now a Wolverine, with all his bones made of Edelman metal, which is incredibly hard. Even if he has super soldier serum, he cannot bear it. 
but this metal can no longer be found. It's impossible for it to flow outside, it has been recycled long ago, so he can only look for a natural metal like Edelman metal, Jinjin, as a means of protecting Wolverine. End of this chapter. Chapter 7 Can I help him hit Wakanda? You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 7 Can I help him hit Wakanda on his way to find Wolverine, there will be a gold dealer named Crow. It can be said that most of the current circulating funds in the market come from him, because he is from Wakanda. This Xinjin trafficker was recently in Fulian too, but he sold a lot of Xinjin to Ao Chuang. Otherwise, Ao Chuang would not be able to build a Xinjin body. He just didn't expect to have his arm cut off by Ao Chuang just because he said the wrong thing. Coincidentally, all the gold in this guy's hands is sold to the villains, so it's okay to use it yourself. Shen Fei stepped on the accelerator all the way, and Jeep quickly emerged, rolling up dust and sand. Jeep rode the dust and disappeared from the sight of everyone running out of the base. The soldier captain looked at the disappearing car and shouted, Damn it! He had people chase after him quickly, but soon the security personnel found that the rear wheels of the car were all protruding, and they were so angry that they kicked the car door and said, Damn Shen Fei! Boss, he is driving our prison car. Previously, in order to escape from those goods, he deliberately installed a tracking device on the car. A person next to him took out a notebook and quickly said. Under his tapping, a route quickly appeared in front of them, and it continued to extend. Seeing this, the soldier captain's face showed a faint smile and said, Very good, very good. At this moment, a fighter jet broke through the clouds, plunged down, and finally landed at the entrance of the research institute. The captain of the soldiers saw the fighter jet and his eyes lit up. The super squad sent by the adults has arrived, and now Shen Fei is doomed. Several fully armed super soldiers jumped off the fighter jet, and even the elite security personnel couldn't help but feel a little nervous when they saw these super soldiers. After all, they have all seen the brutality of these super soldiers, and even the protagonists in some of their combat skills videos are these super soldiers. Seeing these super soldiers, the soldier captain quickly walked up and said with a smile, Everyone, this guy has already been tracked by us. As long as you hold this computer, you can catch up with him. This guy definitely can't run far the super team led by them took a glance at the computer and nodded, follow the orders of the adults. Let's execute them all. As soon as the words fell, everyone was stunned. What happened? But before he could react, the super soldier behind the man quickly raised his gun and began quickly killing these people. A series of gunshots and screams rang out, and blood flowers appeared on the wilderness, flowing on the mud and sand. The super soldier led by him is reporting the situation on the phone. Well, send someone to clean up the entire research institute and put the data on the fighter jet. Especially in the laboratory where Shen Fei was at that time please bring back the residual samples from inside. Then go catch Shen Fei. Yes. In a small town. Now Shen Fei looked at a N.I. brother and said, I'll sell you this car for two thousand. Two thousand. Are you sure? N.I. Gu looked at Jeep beside him and felt a little tempted. If it weren't for the gun on the yellow-skinned monkey and the blood-stained white coat on his body, he would have directly taken action. But it's not a loss now, it only costs $2,000. This is simply a big deal. After a moment, Shen Fei watched as N.I. Gu drove Jeep away, shook his head, and walked into the pharmacy. He still needed something to be safe on the road. Not long after, Shen Fei came out of a bar, his face changed slightly, his skin became much fairer, and his clothes were also changed. Chase me slowly. When you find me, I won't be able to compete with you anymore. Shen Fei shook his head and went to the stable next to the bar. He looked at a cowboy feeding grass and said, You give me a ride. This thousand dollars and your own life are yours. The cowboy looked at Shen Fei, who was directly pointing a gun at his head to discuss business. He nodded from the bottom of his heart and said, Yes, yes, brother. 
Where did you want me to take you? Here. Shen Fei reported a location. The cowboy quickly nodded and said, I know there. Two horses and two people started running towards the next small town. On a road, a NI guy hummed rap and drove a newly acquired jeep. The performance of this car is very good, and when he plays it for a while and sells it, he can still make a lot of money. He didn't notice a fighter jet staring at him in the sky. The leader of the super soldiers inside the fighter jet looked at Jeep below and called to report, the research institute has activated the self-destruct function, and all data has been transferred. Shen Fei. Not lost yet. Okay. Go and get him back. Duh duh duh. A series of flames shot out from the fighter jet, and N.I. Gu, who was originally humming a tune, was startled by the sudden burst of flames ahead and quickly stepped on the brakes. N.I. quickly opened the car door, crouched down with his head in his arms, and loudly said, I am from the United States, not illegal immigrants. Suddenly, several figures fell down in front of N.I.G.E.'s eyes, and the super soldier led by them frowned and growled, Who are you? I. Forget it. The person next to him casually fired a bullet into Nee's eyebrows, causing him to fall to the ground with a frightened expression. Sir, it's not Shen Fei in this car, he said damn it. His previous car image has been disconnected from surveillance, so it must have been replaced at that time. Turn on the radar and satellite to see who is using navigation. When this guy was running for his life, he could still think of this. Go and take a look at Crow's place. The Baron's voice was not irritable, how easy was it for the nine-headed snakes in the United States to find someone? In the wilderness, if it were in the city, it wouldn't take long for a special team to catch Shen Fei. Yes. The captain of the super soldier with a metal arm signaled for them to blow up their car and return to the fighter jet. Start connecting various devices and searching for Shen Fei's whereabouts. On the other side, the cowboy respectfully dismounted Shen Fei. He originally planned to throw Shen Fei off his horse on the way. Who knew that Shen Fei, who originally seemed not good at horses, rode for a while? Although he may not have become an experienced horse, the fierce horse did not exhibit much rebellion under his control. With Shen Fei holding the gun in his hand, he had to obediently deliver Shen Fei here. Quickly, Shen Fei walked into the bar and soon he noticed that the people sitting in the bar had some unpleasant expressions. I originally wanted to do something, but when I saw the gun on Shen Fei's waist, my eyes moved away. Those who openly carry guns, especially those for military use, rather than civilian use, are all ruthless characters. Shen Fei scanned around, and these people looked at him without any concern. It seems that this is a gray area nearby. Shen Fei came to the table and the bartender casually asked, What would you like? I'm looking for Crow. Shen Fei noticed that as soon as he finished speaking, many people looked at him, and some even stood up. The bartender smiled and said, Mr. Crow is no longer a troublemaker. These are all people who rely on him to eat. Kid, pay attention to what you say. You tell him that I can help him seek revenge. Revenge. Ha ha ha, what story are you telling? The bartender laughed heartily, and some people also laughed and said. Shen Fei's face remained unmoved. I can help him defeat Wakanda. End of this chapter. Chapter 8 With this. You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 8 With this the bartender was momentarily stunned when he heard Shen Fei's words, and the others were also momentarily stunned. After all, he is making a living under Crow, so naturally he knows more or less about Wakanda's situation from Crow's mouth. This looks like something that has been messed up, yet he even said he wants to help Crow defeat Wakanda. Are you joking? At this moment, a burly man stood up and sneered, Just you, this guy. Getting up seemed like a little giant walking towards Shen Fei, reaching out to pat Shen Fei's face. As he reached out, he said, Little thing, I don't know where you got the news from. But you should know that speaking recklessly comes at a cost but his hand was instantly grabbed by Shen Fei. 
I soon realized that my hand seemed to be wrapped in an iron hoop, and even my bones were clattering, making the big man unable to resist the urge to pull out his hand. Shen Fei continued to exert force, click click click. The Han's originally teasing expression suddenly became very painful and he shouted, What the hell is this? Ah! In everyone's surprised eyes, Shen Fei bent the big man's palm at an angle that was not normal, and then kicked him in the abdomen. There's so much nonsense. With a loud bang, the big man was kicked back to his original position, smashing the tabletop into pieces. Two wine bottles fell on his head, feeling dizzy in his mouth was still making painful screams. A few men wanted to make a move when they saw Shen Fei raise his gun and said, If you go up one by one, I don't need a gun. If you go up together, don't blame me. This sentence suppressed several abnormal men. The others couldn't help but speak up and discuss, what kind of ruthless person is this? One hand is useless to a lone wolf, and speaking up is to find Mr. Crow. This guy can't mess with you. You didn't see his figure under his clothes, he could kill you with just one punch. The rest of the people's gaze also turned away. In this gray area, as long as you have strength, there are people who respect you. At present, it seems that this Chinese-American holding a gun has a considerable background, and it seems that he is willing to help Mr. Crow build the confidence of Wakanda. If Crow thinks I'm just a child's play, do you ask him if he knows about Hydra? When the bartender was about to leave, he was stopped by Shen Fei and heard his words. The bartender couldn't help but be stunned for a moment. What is a Hydra? But with Shen Fei's demonstrated ability and information, the bartender nodded and said, then I'll go get some wine from behind. After speaking, he turned around and walked into the back. Shen Fei is not in a hurry either. This guy must have gone to contact Crow. This bar is often bustling with people who rely on Crow to make a living, and according to the records of Hydra, Crow used to trade in this bar. The actual controller of this bar must be Crow. Quickly, the bartender came out and handed a bottle of wine to Shen Fei, saying, Drink this and Mr. Crow will be willing to see you. Shen Fei looked at the dark cup of things and said coldly, Do you really think I have a request for him? Tell him, if you don't want to be approached by the contemporary Black Panther. Just come out obediently, we still have cooperation to discuss. You should know that the current comeback plan is to bring the Black Panther into the team. Can you ask him if he can withstand the tracking of the Divine Shield Bureau? Can you still withstand Iron Man after Shen Fei finished speaking, he shook his head and turned around before leaving. This guy even planned to give him a slap in the face, just kidding. Give him a warning before the transaction and he'll eat it. If he drank this bottle of wine, he should be able to see Crow, but he must have been overwhelmed by his aura. Shen Fei doesn't like being pinned down on him, and this crow is just a trafficker. If it's really not possible, he can even switch targets. If they sell crow intelligence to Wakanda, they will definitely be happy. As soon as the others stood up, Shen Fei aimed his gun at them and said, If you dare to move around, don't blame my gun for not having eyes. Shen Fei had not even stepped out of the bar when he heard someone speak, Young man, don't be so anxious. At this moment, a person came out from the back kitchen of the bar, and Shen Fei turned his head to look at the person who had always been there, which was the appearance of Crow on the profile. But it may be because I lost my arms and my complexion is not very good. Crow, I didn't expect you to be here. Aren't you really afraid of the Hydra causing you trouble? Shen Fei didn't expect this guy to be so bold and wait in this bar. Klaus smiled and said, if I hadn't been bold, I wouldn't have stolen Jinjin from Wakanda back then. After laughing, Crow's face turned cold and he said, let's go. Let's go somewhere else to chat. Let's go. After leaving the bar, there was already a car waiting. Go to another place, if you don't want those crazy dogs squatting in our house, said Shen Fei as soon as he got into the car Klaus stared at Shen Fei, his eyes seeming to be about to choose someone, picked up his phone, and made a phone call. Everyone evacuate, he said, you have destroyed a safe house for me. 
Are you still called a safe house when the Hydra finds out? They just don't want to mess with you, or they think it's risky to mess with you. You are actually a prey that others value, it depends on when you need to be eaten Shen Fei countered, unwilling to be outdone, saying that since he could obtain information about Klaus from the nine-headed snake, it indicated that Klaus had long been under their control. Either it's to wait for Crow to become more useful before swallowing it, or it's to plan on fishing. For example, like this. This can be considered as compensation for you. Shen Fei threw out a stack of paper, and when Klaus looked over, he realized it was a pile of design drawings. Shen Fei smiled and said, the mechanical arm can be made of vibrating gold, much stronger than your chopped arm. After installation, you can also become a superhero Klaus also understands, after all, he works in metals and can still understand such things. Looking at Shen Fei, this blueprint is worth a lot of money, and it is so precise that he spent a lot of money but couldn't find it. This contains the steel technology of Zetery technology and the study of the human body structure by Hydra. Can perfectly adapt to the human body this is a blueprint that Shen Fei casually pulled out, and for him, it's just a small case. Driving After glancing twice, Crow spoke up. The vehicle began to drive and soon appeared at the entrance of a cave. Outside the cave, there were people holding firearms, who were still vigilant in pointing their guns at anyone who came. But when you see the vehicle, immediately put down the gun. After getting off the car, Crow and Shen Fei walked into the cave. Soon, a huge interior appeared in Shen Fei's sight, no different from a normal room. Even the mountain walls on both sides were flattened and tiled. It's all about hollowing out the mountainside and building a house inside. You said you could help me fight Wakanda. Why? As soon as he sat down, Crow asked coldly and handed the blueprint in his hand to the secretary next to him, who looked like a big star and had a well-proportioned appearance. With this, Shen Fei knocked on his head and said with a smile. End of this chapter. Chapter 9 I Have No Money You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 9 I have no money Claude didn't laugh at Shen Fei's action, because the information he said, combined with the abilities he has shown so far, is definitely not a person with a brain problem. But still made such a move. That is something to rely on. Quickly, a person wearing a white coat rushed out and whispered in his ear. Claude's eyes lit up for a moment, then he looked at Shen Fei again, this is indeed a real thing, it can perfectly fit the human nerves. If it were sold, it would be worth a lot of money. Are you giving it to me like this? Shen Fei glanced at the person wearing a white coat, it was obvious that he was a technician. It seems that Crow has verified its completeness, so I am interested in talking to him now. It's just a technology, sooner or later it can be developed. Aren't you also studying it? I'm sure you've been studying it for quite some time. As for money. Is a robotic arm worth the entire Wakanda Shen Fei's words made Crow's originally lying body stand straight, staring at Shen Fei and asking, how much do you know? It's much more than you imagine. For example, the imprint on your neck, the Xinjin you stole. And your plan to seek revenge. Hmm, money leopard. Upon hearing Shen Fei's words, Claude's eyes changed from indifference to extreme surprise, with even a hint of fear in them. He couldn't help but ask, how did you know? It's not surprising if the source of branding or vibration gold is known, as the entire Wakanda community knew it back then. But later it involves his revenge plan and the money leopard. Apart from him and the money leopard, no one would know, could it be that the money leopard betrayed him? Shen Fei smiled and said, there are some special people in this world, don't you also know? Claude took a deep breath, and what Shen Fei said earlier was clearly telling him that Shen Fei was such a person. Since he manages Xinjin, he has had contact with many people, but often only a superficial experience. The most influential ones are naturally Ao Chuang and Fu Yin. What did you mean before? Black Panther. The current guardian of Wakanda, the son of the former Black Panther, Tekala, 
is about to lead Wakanda to be revealed to the world. And he is also a candidate that the Divine Shield Bureau has been paying attention to. If there is communication between both parties, and you still have a huge amount of Jinjin in your hands, do you think you will become a target of the Divine Shield Bureau? The charge is to disrupt friendly exchanges between the two countries Shen Fei's words left Klaus a little stunned, and there is such a saying. What do you need? Claude had already believed Shen Fei's words, and the most crucial thing was what Shen Fei had said about his revenge plan. Plus, he has also seen Fu Yen before. If Fu Yen wants to deal with him, he may not be able to escape either. This guy must have some means to easily reveal so much relevant information, but Claw is still a businessman. Not only for the meeting ceremony, but also for the intelligence mentioned, Shen Fei was nothing more than to enhance his chips before trading. Jinjin Shield A Jinjin Shield similar to a captain. Shield Crow frowned and said, that's not a small amount. Your intelligence is not enough. Adding another 10 million is also considered a discount for you the amount of Jinjin that can create a shield is not a small amount. Although Shen Fei's intelligence is valuable, it is far inferior to Jinjin's shield. Shen Fei certainly didn't have 10 million, but he had another way and said, I don't have any money on me. Crow tapped the table with his only hand and made a loud noise, like a teased hyena, staring at Shen Fei. Are you playing with me, said coldly the people around who were on guard also stared at Shen Fei, as long as their boss gave a command, they would immediately take Shen Fei down. I said, with this. You must have an insurmountable problem at your disposal. I can help you crack it Shen Fei knocked on his own head, this is Shen Fei's way of making money. It takes either strength or wisdom to trap a white wolf empty-handed. But he prefers to use wisdom. In terms of power, he can actually kill the people here in no time. When Crow brought him onto the car, he no longer knew that his life was in Shen Fei's hands. But he needs a partner, and currently it seems that Crow, who has a large amount of wealth but weak self-protection ability, is the best choice. As for Crow being a war dealer. Forget it, how can war traffickers make money in the United States? Are you joking? Look at your meeting gift and intelligence, get out of here quickly. Crow sneered, saying that he no longer believed what Shen Fei said. He was completely a scammer who had nothing to do with a white wolf. As for the design of his robotic arm, I'm afraid he never knew where to get it. Shen Firin is right. After all, he already has a large amount of Jinjin and is naturally researching many technologies related to Jinjin. Although he is wealthy, his network is not very extensive, so the technical personnel hired are not very skilled. Coupled with things like Jinjin, their nature is already extremely unique. There are many difficulties in researching. This guy actually claims to be able to solve it himself. Why not give it a try? I'm here anyway, if I can't handle it. You can kill me anytime, but if I succeed, you'll gain a powerful ally in a lot of what you want. Shen Fei was not in a hurry and said with a smile. The master of scientific research has given him strong learning ability and rationality, so that he will not be angry at all. Klaus saw Shen Fei, who was still so calm in this situation, and stared at him, saying, Sure, if you can't crack it. I'll kill you. Sure. Lawson, lead the way. Take him to Soundwave Arm didn't you just encounter a problem? Show him. The technician next to him looked at Shen Fei with a disdainful expression and jokingly said, Do you need a few years to see the data we are researching? Is this called Shen Fei, a yellow-skinned monkey, here to be funny? Is it only in a short amount of time that they can understand something that they have studied for so long? This involves a large amount of research papers and experimental data. No need, it seems that your research is not too difficult, Shen Fei naturally noticed the disdainful expression on Laudersen's face, in the eyes of these white pigs. They have the strongest talent in scientific research. Chinese Americans are just good at solving problems, but scientific research is not about solving problems. Anyway, it's not me who will die then. 
Lauder's son smiled and said, his eyes flashing with cold light. This yellow-skinned monkey is so arrogant. I will request the boss to personally shoot this guy. Shen Fei glanced at Lawson and after injecting him with super soldier serum, he was somewhat sensitive to danger. This guy had no good intentions. End of this chapter. Chapter 10. Who is Research Waste Now? You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 10. Who is Research Waste Now? Quickly, the three of them kept walking down and arrived at a laboratory paved with pure white walls. Although the laboratory inside was not as good as that of the Hydra, there were also many people busy. After coming down, Crow disappeared, and Lawson led Shen Fei to one of the laboratories where three bald middle-aged people were engaged in intense discussions. And there are still some people on both sides listening. After Lauder Sun came in, he shouted loudly, everyone stop for a moment. The people who were originally in a heated discussion stopped when they heard this sentence and looked at Lawson. The one among the three bald people laughed and said, what were you rushing out to do just now? I've told you to tell the boss that this problem is difficult to solve. Even if it takes some time for the people from the highest education institution, let alone us. Are you the new recruit behind you? No need, this group of useless people can't solve anything, they can only take action and let so many of these research waste come over to do something. Among the three, Medina, with a thin face and a beard, sneered. Lauderson shook his head and said, the yellow-skinned monkey said he can help us solve our problem. The boss asked me to bring him over and give him a try. What a joke, asking someone who hasn't been exposed to our research to solve a problem. Lawson, do you think this is some kind of game? A game that messes up shit. You yellow-skinned monkey, hurry up and get out of here. Don't waste our time. The three of them laughed heartily and said, this is what the boss ordered. As long as he can't solve it, this guy's life will be ruined. Hey, hey, you're still risking your life. Come on, come on, you first understand these things before you speak. Medina threw the paper in his hand in front of Shen Fei and sneered, do you need ten years to take a look? At this moment, Shen Fei's fingers were already constantly flipping through these pages at an extremely fast speed, almost at a glance. In no time, he had finished reading the research record. Is it because Jinjin has absorbed sound waves and is unable to find the corresponding medium for conduction? Do you want to create a vibrating metal that absorbs sound waves from the outside world and then releases oscillation waves of specific frequencies and wavelengths? Can it cause great damage even within half a minute? Shen Fei had already noticed what he was studying in the laboratory, and it was very familiar with it. Even Shen Fei has an impression. Crow in the MCU universe is just an ordinary gold dealer, even though he has learned some techniques, he cannot compare to other professionals. But in the rest of the timeline, Crow was still a top physicist, and with the vibrational gold he received from Wakanda, he developed powerful acoustic weapons and even killed Tekla's father. Now it seems that Claude of this timeline also has such ambitions. But in terms of development. In the end, it should have been unsuccessful and even killed by its ally, the Leopard. The crowd who were originally still watching the joke suddenly froze, because Shen Fei was completely right. The key was that in less than half a minute, the yellow-skinned monkey had finished reading and even found a problem. At present, it seems that one of your molecular calculations cannot solve it. Shen Fei shook his head and didn't care about their eyes. He came to the machine in the laboratory and started operating it. Lauder Sun wanted to stop it, but there was a sound from Crow in his earphone. Let him do it. Shen Fei was checking with one hand and flipping through the experimental records they had placed on the experimental table with the other. Soon, a pile of paper was used up. This thing is much easier than super soldier serum, and they still have so much experimental data, with Shen Fei's current brain and computing power. I have long been able to find the most suitable interval calculation among numerous experimental data. It's just that the proportion of vibrating gold to other metals is not appropriate. If the content of vibrating gold is too high, 
it will lead to the properties of vibrating gold being too large, and the absorbed sound waves will be completely cancelled out. But if the content of Jin Jin is too low, its properties cannot be utilized. They have been unable to estimate the material and proportion. Because the naked eye is not a computer, and computers nowadays do not have this function, because this requires a very appropriate ratio, which requires a large amount of data and research on the characteristics of vibration metal to achieve. Currently, only Shen Fei has such ability. Give it a try. Shen Fei casually handed a stack of things to a technician and said with a smile. Are you joking? Do you really think this can scare us all at once? Lauder Sun originally looked at Shen Fei's extremely serious gaze and movements, as well as his extremely neat experimental methods. I really thought this guy had some skills. But calculating the best material and ratio so quickly is just a joke. Medina regained his senses upon hearing Claude's words and sneered, You yellow skinned monkey, hurry up and die. This kind of thing is not something you can touch. Give it a try. At this moment, Claude's voice came from the laboratory and he spoke in the monitoring room. Just now, I received a message from my younger brother on the other side that my safe house has been taken away. It was taken away by the nine-headed snake. And some extremely terrifying people were also deployed, jumping directly from the fighter jet in mid-air without any damage. Seeing an empty house, his house was eventually bombed. It's definitely not easy to make the nine-headed snake so aggressive. Since that's the case, let him give it a try. Top scientific research talents are popular wherever they are placed. If this Shen Fei really has this ability, a genius comparable to Stark. So he will make a fortune, even if he seeks revenge on Wakanda, and now he has become the illusionary arcane. The technical personnel who took over Shen Fei's data heard the boss say this and began to try. After several operations, the melted Jinjin and three types of metals quickly began to mix in front of everyone's eyes. Quickly, a special thick slurry appeared in everyone's sight. At this moment, Shen Fei pressed the cooling button and a large amount of cold air quickly irrigated. Are you crazy? If it cools down immediately at such a high temperature, it will crack. Lauder Sun roared, this guy doesn't know how to cause trouble here. Shen Fei smiled faintly and remained silent. The air conditioning dissipated, and soon a spherical metal appeared in front of everyone, looking extremely beautiful. Give it a try. The technician quickly took it over for testing, and soon a surprised smile appeared on his face. Done, absorb kinetic energy and then launch and rebound the stored energy. Can control frequency based on continuous current flow. So now who is research waste? Shen Fei looked at Lauder Sun, whose face had changed dramatically because he had become successful, and said with a smile. End of this chapter.